Today, data is everywhere. We use it to make decisions on a daily basis, yet few people give much thought to where it comes from. When it comes to healthcare, data is generated as patients receive care. Clinicians, planners, and policymakers regularly use this information to improve the quality of care and effectively run health systems. Meet Kim. She's a nursing supervisor in a long-term care home. Her facility has recently introduced a fall prevention program, and she'd like to know how effective it is. Kim learned about the Canadian Institute for Health Information. Kaihai, as it's also known, provides information on the health of Canadians and on healthcare in Canada, which Kim might be able to use. But she wants to know that the information is high quality before using it. After all, while high quality data can lead to better decisions, poor quality data can lead to poor decisions. Let's take a look at how a simple error in data collection can impact results. Dates are vital in producing meaningful health information, but mistakes can sometimes occur when recording them. One incorrect or missing date sounds insignificant, but many errors can significantly affect results. Kim wants to know that the dates indicating when falls happened are captured accurately. Otherwise, date errors can lead to artificially high or low numbers of falls within the time period she's interested in. Kim also needs to know that the residents' birth dates are accurate because age often plays a role in healthcare use and outcomes. For example, age is used to identify specific groups of interest such as children, youth, and seniors. Age is also used to validate other information in a record or to link records. A single date error can throw a whole record into question. So how does Kim know whether the information is high quality? Kaiha uses the term fit for use, meaning that people using the information can do so with confidence. In fact, Kaiha has developed an information quality framework to measure and assure fitness for use that draws on international best practices. This framework has five dimensions of quality. Relevance answers questions like, is this the type of information I need to help evaluate my fall prevention program? Accuracy and reliability refers to questions like, does the information correctly measure falls in long-term care? Comparability and coherence would consider questions such as, can I compare results from my facility with results from others, or over time? How does this information fit with other data I might need to use? Timeliness and punctuality looks at information like, is the falls information current? Is it released on schedule? And finally, accessibility and clarity refers to questions like, can I easily find and understand the information? If Kim can answer yes to these questions, then the data is fit for her use. Kaihai and data providers work to ensure that quality data flows from where it's captured into the information products that Kim and others like her can use. As data flows, processes and tools are in place to prevent errors from happening and to identify and correct issues when they do occur. Kim has reviewed the methodology used to produce falls information and now knows how the data was captured and processed. She's confident that she can use Kaihai's information to help her evaluate her fall prevention program. Many people make decisions every day about the best way to deliver care within Canada's healthcare systems. Kaihai works hard together with its data providers to ensure it's a trusted source of quality data and information that people can rely on. Kaihai believes that better data leads to better decisions, ultimately improving the health of Canadians.